Women look great. Women look great. Okay. God God made them. They're supposed to look great. They're supposed to smell great. They're supposed to make you feel a certain way. They're supposed to be your helper. You're supposed to be in between. But tech, they're all these things. Now, Hannah Gabriel was uh, talking about the being of loving and doing things from a different perspective. Her name was Big, and uh, they had like the push and uh, all those things to go on with boxing. What she says is about a, a lot of sexualizing. Sexualizing to me is a word that you look and you devalue somebody because certain ways they make the game look because their beauty or their status. I don't believe in that. I believe um, if you can make it to the top, you're winning. And you're the top Ucho. Oh, I'm some old school dude. You're the top Ucho. You made it. I mean, you really, really ain't got nothing to say if you win. But you got to win. You can't be whining about sexualizing. But if you don't win, you want the popularity. You want all these bikini suits. Listen, it's simple. I tell y'all all this all the time. You got to fight people, man. You got to fight. What, what else you want, want, want? How do you get recognition? You get recognition and validation by putting your name out there and living as a fighter. Not that all the other myths don't matter. The body, the banging looks, the banging stature, status of sex, life, even, even coming through the love of man, no, you don't put those two the two together when you're talking about sexualizing. When you come out there and you feeling and you got a big fight going on, and you don't got one going on, how are you gonna be seen? You can be seen talking. I was seen by running and wrecking more and more in the rain, going in. And I'm being ranked twice as many, many times at 37 years old. When people want to come off and talk about sexualizing and, and status and morals and stuff, start getting your butt out there and make these big time fights happen. Even if it ain't no big time fight. You want to put, put the, your name, you want to put your recognition out there. You want to be popular? Keep fighting. It's very simple. You fight till you retire. That's why it's called boxing. It's a career. Okay, we're, we're going to go to the mo one of the most, well, yeah, 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 yeah. I get her. She probably be the top A plus, the most beautiful lady in boxing right now. Alicia Baumgartner, okay? Alicia Baumgartner, one of the beautiful ladies I've seen yet. But one thing about Alicia Baumgartner, that girl loved to fight. Do I like like her style as a man? Do I like her mojo, her energy, her flow? Hell to the yeah, I love it. It's not only because she's beautiful, might love it. I love looking at her style too. She got a good little style now. Good boss. Hey, I like Michaela. I like Lucky, that, that Lucky Wild Heart. That was a good fight. Layla Lee, I love all these, man. I got to get ready to look at hours of repertoire tonight. So when you sexualize it for men and women, you want to be a bit top, top ranked name, get your butt out there and, and win some titles. Win, fight. How often do you fight? Do you fight in spurts or do you go back to back and gain your record league 30 fights? Man, Augustus made himself famous. Floyd Mayweather, Muhammad Ali. Go back with Layla. Layla was fighting. That what thing get, man, later was taking fights. She was saying, let's go and move to the next one. Go back in the gym and do it again. If you're not making fights, of course you're not going to get the popularity. Of 
course you ain't gonna get no recognition of name because you're not fighting. I got Chick Hand and Gabber record, but I don't look at sexualizing as nothing to do with boxing. I think if you fought more, give put that put them butts in them seats, a lot of people look and see how it works. But y'all a lot of y'all slacking, man. I will be out soon as weather down. Team Muhammad Ali is out. Hope you learn something. Team Ali.